Hi there, I'm Dani from the podcast What Are You Going To Do With That? And this is another video of our series of videos on our YouTube channel. Here in these videos I try to give you a summary of some of the things that I've learned so far from our guests on the podcast. So if you want to know more, please check out our YouTube channel and podcast and subscribe. In the last two videos I spoke about how to deal with working and doing a PhD at the same time, because this has been a recurrent theme. So I found out that there are two main types of doing that, of combining both of these things. The first one is where you do a full-time PhD and then have a part-time job on the side. And the other one, again, is the other way around. So here you go from doing a full-time work to doing a PhD on the side part-time. In the very last video, I spoke about the pros and cons of one of these options. So there I focused on what it's like to do full-time work and a PhD on the side. In this video, I'm going to continue with the other way around. So let's start with what the benefits are of doing a full-time PhD and a smaller job on the side. Of course, the general idea is that if you're able to work full-time on your PhD, you'll be able to finish quicker because you're doing it over a shorter time period. That is, however, not always true, so I'm not sure if you should decide what works for you just based on that. What I think definitely is a benefit of doing a full-time PhD is that you'll be able to get a lot out of your graduate life experience. You'll be able to go to lectures during regular working hours, which you otherwise wouldn't be able to do. So you could go to lectures, you could join certain projects, you can connect with your peers, and you can join conferences. This way, your experience as a graduate student or an early career researcher might also be much less lonely. Some of the cons of doing a full-time PhD and thus only working part-time, of course, is the financial issues you might face. So when you want to do a part-time job in addition to your PhD, it could be important to consider carefully what it is you'd like to do. Don't only look into what the salary is. It's also important to look at the skills you might be developing in that position and also what field that position is in. Maybe this way it can help you later to find a job more easily. Let me give you an example. I worked at the Research Institute, where I also did my PhD. And that gave me some organizational skills, which is handy in any field in any industry. And it also made me understand how the university and its different departments work, which then, as a PhD candidate being there, helped me understand a lot more about their bureaucracy and how to get through it. Of course, this job also helped me network with the people that I was also studying with, but also beyond that of the people who are interested in this field outside of the university. So if you have any tips or stories about how you combine work and the PhD, or what skills you're developing and what you think is important doing that, please let us know in the comments below. You can also find us on any social media account with the handle at what to do with that. And don't forget to subscribe. See you there.